all the history books that we learned in school about the Great Depression are all propaganda. Um, none of them told the truth. They wanted to sell a socialistic agenda and blame cor cor corporations, etc. <clears throat> when I read Herbert Hoover's memoirs, my eyes were just completely wide open. He has in there all the documentation from heads of state back and forth. Um, the first sovereign default began in Austria, and then um, it, it spread to Germany, banks were falling, and if eventually all of Europe defaulted on its debts. Britain was forced into a moratorium, uh, they eventually came out of it. They suspended all interest payments, everything. And Herbert Hoover, in his memoirs, is documenting this capital flow rushing around as governments are, are going into chaos. And it ex explains exactly what happened with Greece. It, he said, capital moved like a, a loose cannon on the deck of a ship in the middle of a hurricane. He says, it was firing off in, in every which direction so fast they couldn't form a committee quick enough to figure out what was happening. Greece, I can tell you, when Greece fell, what did the traders do? They look around, oh, okay, fine, made a bunch of money on that. Who's next? Oh, look at Portugal. Oh, look at Spain. Oh, and it, then they start moving. This is the way capital functions.